Hello, Joel Lindstrom here with a video tip about Dynamics 365 Mobile. Recently, I was presenting at the CRMUG Focus Conference in St. Louis, Missouri, and I did a session about Dynamics 365 Mobile. And I got some good feedback from some of the people who were there, and one of the feedback that I got was about the Dynamics 365 phone app. People saying it was slow, it was unresponsive, it locked up. And so I looked at what, how they were using it, and I found some interesting things that I think are due to some differences between the tablet client and the phone client. And in this video, I wanted to shed some light on those things and give you some recommendations on how you can have a better experience with the phone app. In Dynamics 365 for tablets, you have a bigger viewable area, giving the user access to a lot of information without scrolling. If you swipe left and right on a dashboard or form, it has a nice fluid scrolling effect. With Dynamics 365 for phones, forms and dashboard scrolling works differently. Rather than a continuous scroll across a single page like the tablet app, the phone app, in order to accommodate small device form factors, separates longer forms and dashboards into multiple pages. The page you are on is represented by the page identifier dots on the bottom of the app. Instead of a long continuous swipe to navigate around the form or dashboard on the phone, users instead swipe to change pages. Unfortunately, when you do this, there's no visual animation that it's moving when you swipe, but it usually only takes one to two seconds to swipe to the next page. This becomes a problem when you have impatient users who swipe, then think nothing happened, and then swipe again multiple times. This will make the page transition jump farther than they want to go, or it'll make it appear that the app is frozen and will create a lot of user frustration. To minimize this frustration, I recommend that you teach your users who use Dynamics 365 Mobile for phones on how to swipe correctly, or maybe send them this video. Encourage them to be patient. Swiping more will not make it go faster. Encourage them to be patient. If you haven't already, consider enabling Compact View. This will stack components like dashboard charts, reducing the amount of horizontal scrolling necessary. See tip 836 at crmtipoftheday.com for instructions. And be sure to put special focus on users who switch between the phone and tablet versions of the app. These are the users who are most likely to get frustrated when using the app. And be sure to send your feedback and suggestions about the app to Microsoft. You can do that at ideas.dynamics.com.